To Be Like Jesus, written by Ellen G. White. Come thy fount of every blessing, tune my heart to sing thy grace. Streams of mercy never ceasing, calls for songs of loudest praise. Teach me ever to adore thee, may I still thy goodness prove. While the hopes of endless glory fills my heart with joy and love. Relating to the natural word, August 31st, keep streams of beneficence in constant circulation. Do you not say, there are still four months and then comes the harvest? Behold, I say to you, lift up your eyes and look at the fields, for they are already white for harvest. John chapter 4 verses 35. Human power did not establish the work of God. Neither can human power destroy it. To those who carry forward his work in face of difficulty and opposition, God will give the constant guidance and guardianship of his holy angels. His work on earth will never cease. The building of his spiritual temple will be carried forward until it shall stand complete, and the headstone shall be brought forth with shouting grace, grace unto it. Christians are to be a benefit to others, thus they themselves are benefited. He that watereth shall be watereth also himself. Proverbs 11 verse 25. This is a law of the divine administration, a law by which God designs that the streams of beneficence shall be kept, like the waters of the great deep, in constant circulation, perpetually returning to their source. In the fulfilling of this law is the power of the Christian mission. I have been instructed that wherever by self-sacrifice and urgent effort facilities for the establishment and advancement of the cause have been provided. And the Lord has prospered the work. Those in that place should give to their means to help his servant who have been sent to new fields. Wherever the work has been established on a good foundation, the believers should feel themselves under obligation to help those in need by transferring even at great sacrifice. A proportion or all of the means which in former years have invested in behalf of the work in their locality. Thus the Lord designed that his work shall increase this is the law of restitution in right lines. Oh, to grace, how great a debtor Daily I'm constrained to be Let thy goodness like a fetter Bind me closer still to thee Prone to wander, Lord, I feel it Prone to leave the God I love Here's my heart, O oh, take and seal it Seal it for thy courts above Join us tomorrow for another devotional reading by God's grace Immerse yourself in the word of God and his creation and you will be truly blessed.